I'm just saying, all right? JJ's left you some messages. He sounds stressed. It's an act. Trust me, he's got it. Okay. Now Darren's calling. I don't want anyone knowing where I was all night. Don't you think she's message your mum? She'll be worried. No. She said nothing when everyone stuck up for Jack, and, and she did nothing when Darren wanted me out. I don't care if she's worried, she can go to hell. We all can. Mmm. Uh, what are you doing? Hmm. Whenever I have stuff like this at home, it's all cheap cereal and radioactive juice. <laughs> no, I mean, why are you still here? You're not going to school or home or something. Didn't you hear me before? I want my family to pay, so that means I'm hiding out. For how long? Mm, maybe until Nancy realises that Darren is a doofus and leaves him, or until my mum has a total nervo. Maybe I'll just come out when Jack has his annual heart attack. Frankie, this isn't funny. I know. Look, you can't stay here. I've got to go to school. I don't want to get in trouble anymore. Cart's given me a second chance, and I really don't want to blow it. Well, where am I supposed to go then? I don't know, a hotel or somewhere. Oh yeah, and pay me what? Magic beans? I've got my wallet. Whoa. What's going on here? Nobody tells you about this side of parenting, do they? You are right. Last thing you need right now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, come in. He spoke to Carr, told him we had a situation. He said there could be the time of after I was. How are you? Home. Is that what you call it? I'm not going to ask again. Good. You can show yourself out. Go on then. What exactly happened last night then? Nothing. It's okay, we've already had the chat and it was all above board. And you believe him? If you're asking, do I believe my own son, then yes. As if he's even remotely bothered. I could be hanging out with half the school's rugby team and he wouldn't care. What? Of course I care. No, oh, his creep dad puts his hands on me and he just lets him get away with it. it. It wasn't like that, okay? Nothing happened. My dad asked her for a dance. Yeah, the perv. Right, I've had enough of this, okay? My dad is a good man. He's a kind man. He's not even capable of the things you're accusing him of. Now, I know he's my dad and I would defend him. Of course I would, but this is my daughter. And if for one second I thought anything had happened, I would not hesitate. But you didn't even come after me. No, I didn't. And I'm sorry. Would that have changed anything if I had? But I'm here now, okay? And I'm begging you for this to stop. Look, I want to be a good dad to you. But I can't do that if we're at war with each other. So please, just come home and let's start again. What are you hiding then? Hmm? Nothing. Uh, your secret girlfriend? And Dad's been texting me, like, a lot more than usual. It's kind of weird. I get it, all the Romeo drama and everything, but why is it James? To know. What? I asked you a question. Frankie? Oh. No, she's... she's not my girlfriend. Oh, then what's that about her kipping over, then? She was just going through some family issues, that's all. <laughs> Look, I'm fine with you hooking up with any girl that you want to, all right? Just... not her. Look, Frankie... She can be trouble. I, I just want you to be careful, all right? All right. Look, I just, I don't want him getting hurt. Leah, yeah, please, can you just leave that? Yeah, yeah, fine. <laughs> What's wrong with her? I don't know. I do think she's just looking out for me, though. What are you going to do? Are you going home? I've not really got much of a choice. And this thing with Jack? I don't want to talk about that. Sorry. It's just pretty messed up. It's okay. 
you know, if you got something wrong. Like, there's, there's people that will back you up. Me, JJ. And? Well, come on, it's more protective than Leah. Why are you being so nice to me? Because we're friends. And... And I, and I like you. I've never really had a friend before. We well, do now. Come on. Let's go sort this situation at home, yeah? <laughs>